If you're writing music in a single key, it will usually go like this. Let's say we're in the key of C. If you want to sound major, you'll write your music around the one chord, C major. Start on it, end on it, feature it, etc. If you want to sound minor, you'll write around A minor, the sixth chord. This is traditionally how it's been for literally hundreds of years, and our ears are used to these sounds and expect to hear them. But you don't have to only write around one or six. Clocks by Coldplay. Those chords are E flat major, B flat minor, F minor. On initial listen, it might sound like it's in the key of the first chord, E flat, but it's not. It's in the key of A flat, a chord that's never played in the entire song. This is an example of writing your music around the five chord. We're in the key of A flat, we're writing around E flat. And when you do this, you get these interesting moves like E flat major to B flat minor. When you hear that B flat minor, almost sounds like it's out of the key, but it's not. You're just playing five and then two and then six. These unique sounds come from writing your music around chords that are not one or six.